today we are almost there we are on day number 11 not supposed to be an 11 not a 2 and I'm excited to almost finish this off hopefully you guys are excited watching this let's going on guys my name is Carlos thank you for joining me here on the whiskey corner bourbon and cigars tell your friends <laughs> truly appreciate you guys stopping by checking out the channel checking out this video you have 20 million other whiskey advent calendars to watch so I appreciate you stopping by here you know that's why I try to make these not too long for you guys you guys know I usually go long. Anyways, we are on day number 11. I gotta tell you, I'm actually happy that this will be ending tomorrow on day 12 because this is hard work, guys. As difficult as it is for you guys to watch every freaking WhiskeyTube channel's Whiskey Advent Calendar, it's probably a little harder for us to record this, um, edit it, put it out on time, and make it entertaining for you guys so yeah i think everybody's feeling the pain and i'm dropping out after 12 you know so i commend and i applaud all of those going the full 24. yeah i couldn't commit to that either way we are on day number 11 like i said and if you are new here we took 12 bottles from my bar that were closed sealed we popped them, me and my wife. We poured them into little sample bottles here, and they're blind. I kind of know the 12, but I was mistaken on one of them, so there could be a floating around their bottle that I might not have put on here, or maybe not, or maybe did, if that makes sense. So I don't know. There still might be a Buffalo Trace single barrel in here, or there might not be. So uh, that was actually good planning on my part, even though I didn't plan that out. Anyways, yeah, so we have that. What we're gonna be doing is that we're gonna be tasting it, trying to guess the proof, um, the notes of it, and what bottle it is, right? So I need you guys to do me a favor before we get into it. Please subscribe. That will really, really help out. We have a thousand subscriber. Uh, raffle and a live stream coming up obviously after we pass a thousand subscribers so you guys will be put into that if you're subscribed so we're gonna go with day number 11's sample let me maybe I shouldn't have gotten the Glen until I actually opened up the sample bottle I'm trying not to look I'm trying not to look here we go Yeah, and our poor, poor sample things are coming through because, yeah, that was a bad sample again. Um, you see there, that's probably like two, two tastes, maybe two and a half. I don't know. But either way, let's go in for a nose. Let's go in for a taste. Hmm. Um, that smells good. Um, it might be a little proofy. It went down the wrong pipe in the nostrils. Kind of made me do a, ooh. So I'm getting cinnamon, I'm getting caramel. It's like burnt, burnt sugar, like brown sugar um, as well. Um, some vanilla, some cherries. This smells good, guys. A little hint of oak. Ooh, is that leather? I am loving this nose. This, this smells really good. The first thing that comes to mind is like those squishy um, caramel candies. I don't, know, I don't know if you guys ever ate those from like back in the days. Not a sugar daddy, but they were like square caramel candies. And you used to just chew it until it went away. Um, yeah, that's the first thing that comes to mind. This is good. I'm, I'm, I'm actually intrigued to taste this and see what I believe this is because 
I'm, I'm liking this nose, so cheers. Well, that was a little lackluster, I will say. The taste isn't bad, it's just like the proof doesn't really add up to the nose, if that makes sense. Um, it smelled better than what it tastes. And I think a big component of this is that the proof is not there. If I had to guess on proof, I would say maybe 94, 95, um, which basically this means this is not that Calumet. It could still be the Buffalo Trace. It could still be the um, Nelson Brothers Classic, but it's definitely not Calumet um, 16. So I'm getting, again, a um, little bit of like charred oak. I'm getting cherries, vanillas, um, caramel, burnt sugar. Um, is that oats? Hmm. Like oats. A um, little bit of leather. It, it, it does taste good. I just wish it was a little bit proofier. So cheers, we'll go for the second one. You're getting a, a peppery finish, like a black pepper. Um, so it's letting you know it's there as it's finishing off. And then you're left with the nice little residue of like, of like a chewy caramel. So it does taste good, I will say. Just a little lackluster because I wish they would have put a little bit more proof in it, maybe made this 100 proof, and this would have been perfect. Um, I definitely think this is the Nelson Brothers Classic Bourbon. This does not taste like Buffalo Trace. Um, and it's really good. Um, I believe that thing is like 90 or 92 proof. Um, could be 94, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I think that's what it is. So I'm excited to find out what this is. Uh, yeah, it's good. I would definitely buy this again, or I would have it as a daily sipper. This is really freaking good. And I think that Nelson Brothers Classic is like $30. So yeah, this is gonna be a banger. Let me drink this last one. This is good. Moment of truth, let's see. Am I right, am I wrong? The bottle shall tell us. Yep. Yeah! So yesterday we were five for 10. Today we are six for 11. So we're past the halfway mark because this is Nelson Brothers Classic. Yep. Um, yeah, this was, I knew this was definitely not the Calumet 16. Um, not saying that this is bad. This is actually really freaking good. And I would definitely have this as a pour while I'm barbecuing, while I'm doing some stuff around the house. Um, if I'm just like, you know, don't want anything too proofy, this is a really good one. So if you guys haven't checked out Nelson Brothers Classic Bourbon Whiskey, I think that's what it is, um, go check it out because this is good, especially at $30. Well, that is day number 11. We're gonna wrap this up because it's getting a little bit too long. I need you guys to do those things for me, like, dislike, whatever floats your boat. Please subscribe, because that would really, really help me out. Comment below, let me know how you guys are liking these, what you guys have thought about uh, some of these samples, especially today's sample, which is Nelson Brothers Classic. Um, let me know, comment below. Are you guys happy I'm gonna be ending this? Are you guys, do you guys even care? I don't know. <laughs> but definitely comment below. Um, check out the Patreon in the description, and I think that's it. I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this Nelson Brothers Classic Bourbon, and I want you to enjoy that whiskey. Cheers.